So in this question, we are asked about uh, calculating the final concentration of a substance after 47 uh, seconds. And we have been given a rate constant, which is seconds to the power of minus one. So we know uh, that this must be a first order reaction because uh, time to the power of minus one is typically a first order reaction. So the easiest way to deal with something like that is to uh, first of all write down the equation for a first order reaction. So a final equals a initial the concentration times e to the power of minus k times t final minus t initial. So that is the equation for a first order reaction. And now what uh, we can do is uh, we can make a little table and we can say, okay, our initial concentration, uh, that is 337 millimolar. That's at the start. And our t initial, that is zero seconds. That is when we start the whole thing. Uh, our A final, that is what we want to find out. And our T final, this is 47 seconds. That is when we want to look at the reaction. And our rate constant equals 0 0.071 seconds to the minus one. So now we've got all the information and all we need to do is plug these numbers into the equation. So we have A final equals A initial, that was 337 millimolar times E to the power of minus 0 0.077 one seconds to the minus one times 47 seconds, that was our final uh, um, time minus zero, getting a little bit in the way. So what we can do is let's calculate it as 337 millimolar times e to the minus. So I calculate this 3.337 equals 337 millimolar times, and I calculate this, and that gives me. 0 0.0355 and finally when I calculate this here together I get roughly 12 millimolar.